Hi there, it's me again. So welcome to my new video. And this video was asked by Martina. Hello, Martina. Um, so Martina asked uh, for some tips on how not to pack your fears on how uh, leave behind the just in case items when you pack. So I will focus on my experience and um, I will start by saying that uh, when I, uh, in my middle uh, 20s, I start traveling, I was with a 65 liter backpack and in my early 30s, I already downsized to 32 liters. So how did I do this? First, uh, my first advice and that what I did was to always check um, one month or two months ahead uh, your destination. Check on Google uh, where are the supermarkets, where are the pharmacies, where are the laundromats, uh, where are the shops for clothing or for shoes or for makeup or whatever. Just check and know uh, the city, the place where you are going to stay. And this only will bring you just a little peace and a little uh, uh, secure uh, feeling already. So then you have to check um, your hotel or hostel. Check it the uh, main page of the hotel or the hostel if you have uh, there some laundry services some iron some hair dryer some towels uh, what toiletries are there for you to use toiletries um, you may ask by message on all uh, platforms of booking uh, hotels or hostels or air, air Airbnb, so uh, that you can have the perception, the whole perception of all that you gonna have when you stay there. Then you're gonna start packing one month ahead. Uh, just pick up your suitcase or backpack or whatever that you wanna downsize to. Uh, then pick up all the clothing that you are wanting to uh, go with you. All the shoes, all the makeup, all the skincare, all the stuff that you wanna pack and put it all, all over your bedroom or uh, living room or another piece of your house. Now, uh, look at the size of your pack uh, the one that you are downsizing to and look at all the stuff that you remove from your wardrobe, from your shoe uh, rack, uh, whatever, and see if it fits all there. Of course, it doesn't. <laughs> so for the following uh, four weekends, uh, one month ahead, you start doing this you will um, apply censorship to the things that you brought up from the shelves or from the wardrobe. Um, let's see, uh, first, what things, what piece of clothing, uh, shoes, uh, skincare, whatever, did you uh, pack the last two, two or three times uh, before? and that you never used or uh, barely used. The, these are the first items that you should remove. Now look at your clothing, all the clothing that remains. Uh, choose those pieces of clothing that are wrinkle free or they are versatile, that can um, mismatch with the um, other pieces of clothes. It's easier if you choose the bottoms in dark, uh, like black, uh, dark blue, uh, gray, 
and the upper uh, items in uh, colorful um, patterns. So uh, if you use this uh, roll, it will be easier. But you can uh, also uh, mismatch one dress, for instance, with a shirt. You can put a shirt over a dress with a belt and uh, it looks uh, like a new outfit. So now, uh, unless you are on an Airbnb or hostel uh, with a shared bathroom or a shower, you don't need uh, shower flip-flops or uh, bedroom uh, shoes or even pajamas. Um, you will wear uh, your underwear with some shirt, regular shirt, and will be okay to sleep on. So uh, this is the beginner uh, method uh, that starts two months or uh, one month earlier to your trip. Um, the downsizing of clothes and shoes and all the items happens every weekend by applying censorship to those uh, cr criteria like I never use this despite I always bring it. Um, it's not gonna uh, be that cold for this uh, winter jacket. Um, the clothes mismatch with it all together. And um, then uh, two, uh, three to four days before you leave, you will check the weather and see if your choices are a according uh, um, to the weather that you're gonna encounter at your destination if it's all good you're done see if it all fits on your new uh, suitcase or backpack now my second method of doing this downsizing um, this method is little by little so uh, you'll start by choosing two or three outfits two or three pairs of shoes and the least amount of skincare and other things that you can live uh, without <clears throat> then you pack uh, your bag with those things and go away for uh, let's say a weekend two days uh, let's see if you miss something when you arrive home again then you start doing this longer and longer first you will start by doing a weekend then four days or five days then seven days then seven days plus three days let's say ten days then two weeks if you achieve two weeks 15 days with this small amount of, of outfits and uh, shoes and all the other things you are ready to uh, go my third method just think that uh, suddenly um, your house gets on fire um, there's an earthquake there's a flooding all over your town and inside your house and you have about 30 minutes to leave your house with all your essentials what will you pick up in 30 minutes just put your clock on 30 minutes and start packing a little backpack or suitcase or whatever you choose but you only have half an hour to do it okay and these were my three methods of downsizing your pack um wish that you can find this video useful and see you on my next video thank you for watching bye